Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Ball Z! When we last left off, um, everyone just got their ass kicked by Nappa and Goku is on his way. But before we go anywhere, I think there's a Dragon Ball over here. Actually, um, well... Yeah, it's a fight. Okay, so after this fight there'll be a Dragon Ball. I'll cut this bit out to you guys. Okay, so you guys didn't really miss much. It was just a fight with the Cybermen that lasted all the five seconds. But I think that's all, so let's head towards the big glowing. And what that is, it's like an energy field. <laughs> I don't understand what that is. Goku! We've been waiting for you! Dad! So you're finally here. Trying to look tough? You don't scare me! It just makes me want to kill you quicker! I won't forgive you for hurting my friends! Impossible! What does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! What? 9,000?! <laughs> A little punk like you can't do anything against the mighty Nappa! <laughs> Goku's pissed. Nappa sounds... more pissed. <laughs> yeah, let's kick the crowd. This is not a combo I do very often. Using the X to do chains rather than the Y. No, it just doesn't seem as strong. It doesn't do as... well, it doesn't seem to do as much damage and doesn't build up in the spirit. So I... It's not something I, I choose to do too often. Now let's see if we can just win this fight really quick. Let's just beat the crap out of Nappa. Dodge for Chaozu! How did Goku know? No one told him when he got there. See, that combo did much more damage. We get a little extra since I'm in uh, Spirit. No, I don't know what that mode's called kind of when you reach the max on your key um, and then you press up on the d-pad and he sort of goes into a crazy thing where everything's just everything just works out great for him <laughs> I don't really know how to say it oh we're in the face I probably shouldn't have done that I don't think Goku just Goku ever use the Kaioken on Nappa Darn it! I'm an elite Saiyan warrior! I won't let a lower class fighter like you look down on me! Calm down, Nappa! How can you fight him if you're so angry you can't even see straight? Right. Thanks, Vegeta. I needed that. Now, Kakarot, I hope you're ready. Probably should have saved some key for this. All I can do is weather the blow. No, he shook two fingers up at me. What a grave insult. God damn you, Nappa. Yes, we get it. There's a giant crater now. A couple more combos on him, he should be... Should be toast. Right? Yeah, he's almost toast as it is. Might finish him off with a Kamehameha. Just have to see how I feel. Yeah, Kamehameha. Kamehameha! So you catch this with your teeth, Nappa. Oh, just, <laughs> it was so close to just finishing him. So close. I know Nappa. Ah, he's dead. Boom. How can vanish? Which I did on him before. <laughs> Oops. It, may, it, may, it makes me laugh as well. You, know, you, you see all these super attacks and whatever, and the damage they leave on the ground. <laughs> That should put an end to your fighting! 
Now get off our planet and take this oak with you. Uh, uh, darn you! Ah! A Saiyan who can't move is worthless. Die! Let's take this somewhere else. <laughs> Do as you please. Alright, so this is a chase battle, which is not really a, a battle. Anyway, in this mode, the pursuer gets behind you and button inputs occur as you are chased down. Skillfully escape and gain separation from your opponent. Um, okay, so we just gotta avoid Vegeta by basically not having him. When he's right behind you, he kind of gets, uh, oh, like, I don't know, what's, what's it called in the car? Like, drafting, just kind of, they catch up to you. So you just, gotta, just gotta keep away from him, so he doesn't glow purple. Like he's doing right now, but damn it. Okay, that was, that was easy enough. Figures, he's keeping up with me easily. Okay, there won't be any people or animals around here. So, this is where you've chosen as your final resting place? Here's a treat for you, Kakarot. It's rare that a low-class warrior like you gets to fight someone like me. If he tries hard enough, any fighter can beat an elite in battle. You think so? Well, let me show you just how useless trying hard is. Yeah, Vegeta, at least it's just a title. Which is a shame, because Vegeta's my favorite. He's still a pretty badass, though. And he's the only one in like, the whole of Dragon Ball who has any sort of real character development going on. And he starts off as an absolute asshole and ends up realizing, I think at the end of the, well towards the end of the Boo Saga, it's the point where he realizes, uh, you know, why Goku's stronger than him. Because he's actually fighting for a purpose, not for himself. It's quite, quite nice, quite nice for him to realize as well. It took him long enough though. It's like, what's the time Goku plans to go Gohan's about, what, 18 at the end of the Boo Saga, so that would make it, how old is he, he's like 5 at the beginning of the same, so it's like 30, it took him like 13 years to like eventually realise. Looks like you've reached your limit, it's time to finish you off and show you the true power of an elite Saiyan warrior! Show me what you've got! Ah! It's over, Kakarot! Ah! No, Kurt! Vegetables is going to beat you! Don't be silly. Vegetables can never beat carrots. Up you go. Boom, boom, boom. Let's use uh, whatever up is. Up. Oh. oh, okay. And vegetables can't counter it. In the face. But he's fine, and look at the damage I did to the air. I'm probably going to destroy it myself. I'm a super elite! There's no way a lower class warrior like him could beat me! Blood! How could a piece of trash like him draw blood from a noble? You're dead. I'm going to make you pay! I don't need this blasted planet anymore! I'll destroy your precious Earth, Kakarot, and you along with it! 
What? What the? I'll blast you and your planet to pieces! Uh oh. Uh oh. Town's right, Goku. Beam battle here. Do I have to do anything? Nope. Goku wins. Vegeta exploded. That's not how it happened. Yeah, he's still alive. Yeah, I didn't expect him to go down so easy. I am a Saiyan, the most powerful warrior in the universe! I hate to resort to this, but he's left me with no choice. I'll transform into a great ape and crush him! That's strange. The moon should have been out long before now. That's it folks, we'll leave it here this episode, um, I guess because you guys wanted it to run on weekends as well, we will continue this fight um, Saturday and hopefully finish the Saiyan Saga by Sunday. So you guys got something to look forward to over the weekend. Uh, they might be a little bit late, the uploads, um, because I do have other things I have to do on the weekends, but they'll be up on the day. It might be five minutes to midnight, but it'll be up. <laughs> but hopefully not. Hopefully I can get it up around six or seven. It just depends how busy I am. Okay guys, so I hope you enjoyed this episode of Goku and Vegeta mainly. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys!